So it seems the Ontario government's pleas for the Bank of Canada to lower interest rates has fallen on deaf ears. What we find interesting is that while the Bank of Canada has decided to stick to their proverbial guns and not reduce the rate, the market shows buyers have adjusted to the higher interest rates. Hopefully you went for the variable mortgage so that you can take advantage when the rates finally drop. On the flip side, these brave buyers are helping to bolster sales and bring back some healthy competition that caused a moderate increase in the average March home price year over year. While this isn't great news for buyers hoping to enter the market, it does provide opportunities for sellers who have sat on the sidelines for the last several quarters. So we're hoping that the fact March new listings were down 3% compared to February means maybe sellers will be more willing to step up to the plate to take advantage of that competition before the market gets too saturated. According to Trev President Jennifer Pierce, the numbers do offer hope that homeowners will be inspired by the improved prices and brave the waters to help increase inventory. And remember sellers, it's all in the timing. We're already at the deadline where the decision to list loomed, so deciding to sell sooner than later will help you see those higher prices while lower inventories drive buyer competition. Because despite the Bank of Canada's decision to hold on to those interest rates, they've got to do something hopefully in early summer to lower borrowing costs. When this happens, you lose your advantage. Now buyers, we feel your pain. We were disappointed to see the rates didn't drop, and have our fingers crossed for you in the coming months. But a friendly reminder, once the rates start to drop, demand will increase for listings and prices will start to rise. The tides will start to turn towards a seller's market, which means you will be paying more. Any gains you made by lower interest rates, gone. Now is the sweet spot where you can get a variable mortgage, lower prices, and then weather the storm until you reap the rewards with each interest rate drop. Adding to buyer hope, condo apartment sales were historically low in the fourth quarter of 2023, of course because of those darn high borrowing costs. As with the rest of the housing market, once those interest rates start dropping, many first-time buyers will feel the shift towards affordability. And again, we say grab that sweet spot now, while new condo apartment listings are up by more than 29% year over year and sales are down. Supply and demand could mean finding the perfect price thanks to more negotiating power. When combined with a variable mortgage, you could be homeowner bound. We say free yourself from ridiculous rents and give home ownership a try. Think of it. Every cent you put into your sheltering costs becomes an investment in your own asset. Still not sure what to do? We're around if you need us. Bye for now.